Now, while dog owners love their pets, it's not often we celebrate the working dogs of the world. I stopped by the Henry Ford, where they're currently highlighting dogs with jobs. He's very friendly. You can pet him and say hi. Meet Moss, an eight-year-old border collie who's also the director of wildlife management at the historic Henry Ford House. And he has the business cards to prove it. Moss's main job is herding geese away from the Ford House grounds to keep them clean. So Moss came to us uh, from a, a breeder uh, who trained him originally on sheep and then he transitioned to geese. Uh, and so I actually uh, really inherited just an amazing dog. Carl Cotto is the Ford House Director of Landscape. He says you can find Moss outside working or taking a break in the visitor center where you can actually purchase a Moss stuffed animal. Cotto says Moss loves his job, but like many of us, he could do without all the meetings. When he's sitting in the meeting, uh, you know, he'll roll over on his belly and let us all know that it's time to, to end the meeting. Dogs with Jobs ties into the Henry Ford's Paw Patrol exhibit. And we know the pups have very important jobs, but real dogs have jobs too. Lori Petrellius is a museum program manager. She says they've had visits from therapy dogs and leader dogs for the blind. It's also been a really great way for little ones to learn how to appropriately approach a dog um, and how to ask, you know, if it's okay for them to pet the dog. Now, there are two more weekends of the Dogs with Jobs event. Those will feature police canines and search and recovery dogs.